Hey friends, this is a story about false gods, American religion, and all that. So I'm going to share a few stories from last weekend's New York Times. Now, keep in mind that the hell I went through in getting gaslit out of my own profession, <laughs> that was hard, but I've recovered and I do see things differently now. And I believe the true word of God is Christ on the cross. Father, forgive them for they do not know what they're doing. And you know, uh, a famous psychiatrist taught us this over 100 years ago, Dr. Sigmund Freud. He explained that all this hurt in the world comes from subconscious projections of a lot of smart people who love each other, but they hurt each other in ways that are just hard to understand. I get that now, all right? So uh, first we have Maureen Dowd, Trump, blasphemous Bible thumper. Maga's false god is wallowing in his Messiah complex. There's truth to that, folks. I mean, I see so many of my family and friends who kind of elevate Donald Trump to a godlike status. But so do people who honor and worship and follow celebrities of any kind. Can Beyonce say Biden? What happens when celebrities and politics mix in 2024? Well, it's been happening for centuries, all right? People glom on to worship celebrities for whatever reason and kind of raise them to a godlike status, all right? Um, then we also have those who will put their faith and trust in technology, how AI chatbots chat bots become political. Well, everything's political for heaven's sakes. AI generated garbage is polluting our culture. So here this author is kind of judging AI to be more negative. Uh, the point here is that, again, going back to the true word of God, Father, forgive them. They do not know what they're doing. Over the centuries, many of us humans have been worshiping false gods. And in my case, uh, our government in Colorado worshiped <laughs> data, evidence, uh, the pseudoscience of uh, psychiatry. All right, we kind of forgot what Dr. Sigmund Freud taught us, and we've been coming up with all these psychological, psychiatric theories that have not helped us humans over the last hundred years. I mean, it's made money for the psychiatric industrial complex, but it has not furthered human understanding. 